Um. Oh. Well, I guess it's starting. <laughs> <laughs> So I guess we're here now. Great. I was just testing it out, but I guess it's happening now. <laughs> what if people say how funny would that be? Hmm? Uh description and <laughs> So it's a mistake. <laughs> oh, my poor computer is crying. I love it. That's not what I wanted, you know? Mm. Let's see, there's Michael. Um, there's Rich. Chloe's the only one. Chloe and Jenna are the only ones that don't, I believe. Yeah, that makes sense, though. Gosh. Hey, it's perfect. That's it though. It's just Rich, Jake, Brooke, Michael, and Christine. This is gonna be in my head all the time now. No, I want to delete this whole part right here. Get rid of it. I just want to see if the stream is actually picking up every audio. That's why I'm still having it on. Oh gosh. That's not how to spell. I can't spell. Great! Cool. I don't want that. Um... Right now? What? Are people watching this right now? Are they really? <laughs> right now? No. Okay, hi. So. I can't believe this. Yes, it is a dating sim for Be More Chill. What? Hold on, I have to think. I'm going to YouTube now. Yeah, so I was just testing out the streaming thing, and I guess it just decided to happen. I'm curious, though, can you guys hear, like, can you guys hear the game music or just our voices? Can I find their YouTube channel? <laughs> I was looking for it too and I could not find it. It's so hard to find, I don't find it. Okay, um, Does I can. can suppress us? I guess I should link the Cloud novel in the. You can only kind of hear the music because, um. It's at 1%. It's at 1% because it's super loud otherwise. I can't make I can find oh my gosh dang you. Oh boy. <laughs> can you can you send me a link to our YouTube channel? What? I can't find it. I know, okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Did I spell Michael right? <laughs> 
That's a big mood. Okay. Don't look at that, please. Um, no, I spelled it right. It's good. That's not how to spell novel at all. We're 100% suppressed by YouTube, obviously. That's okay, I'm glad you can hear both of us because last time that was a problem. <laughs> that was indeed a problem. We found out it was a Discord problem. Okay, um, um, um. Got it, whatever. Bye. That is seven. There you go. That's the link to the game. Do not look at any of that stuff. You don't need that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> That's the link to the game. Um, you have to download the zip file. And if you don't have anything like WinRAR, you have to extract it. Oh yeah. Um, the hardest route is Michael root because you can't. <laughs> You can't do anything wrong. Can I can confirm. I could not do it without asking for help. It's impossible. <laughs> you have to make Michael mad apparently. Yeah, and one of them you have to make him upset and I was so confused because I could not get the right answer because I thought the one that was wrong was right. But the one that was wrong was the one that didn't make him mad. <laughs> I don't think that made any sense, but yeah. Make sense to me. Hard. I just wanna- okay. I'm just gonna have the chat open there. Wait, are you- are you on the same place as me? Text-wise? Yes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you know you're gonna kill us. Harley, that sounded like it hurts. I mean, we have Becca here who has successfully gotten the Michael ending, so... Have indeed. With a lot of help. Can yes. Can you send me a link to our channel? I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can you, can you log on on your phone? Maybe. Because <laughs> if you do and you just go to our channel, it's on the main page. Let me see. Freaking goddamn YouTube. It's okay, Lena. We love you. If you guys are on the stream, go do the survey I posted in the server. Wait, what's the question? Why are you saying what? Libraries? No, accounts. I like how it's still the the live stream is still called Secret Game Time. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> once we figure stuff out, <laughs> we're gonna play. Apparently, <laughs> I guess we're doing this now. Yeah. Um. Are you at the place where I met? Uh. Yeah. I'm just trying to find your freaking channel. Okay. Got down. It's. <laughs> A Gmail account. Why, why is this so weird? Why is this literally so weird? It's a big hot mess. That's a mood. Google McGoogle. Google McDoodle. Attracted. <laughs> Google McDoodle. Is Michael's. Is it. E-A or A-E? <laughs> it's been this long. <laughs> Listen. It's A-E. Oh, the reason oh. I didn't find it is because there was a, a space in between. Alright. No! Oh my god. I'm gonna die. Is the really scary? No, what we're doing. It's fine. We don't know our YouTube channel. No, name. we don't even know our own YouTube channel. No, it's A first, not E. Dummy. No, you're not dumb. I'm sorry, it was a silly mistake. I found her channel. Uh, I think Michael's sprite is A plus. Uh, I love it. That's love me. All yeah, all the sprites are really good. Jelly did a great. Guys, I'm watching this. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, 
I don't know exactly how this game goes because this is the first time I've ever played it. But. My computer can actually stream now. That's amazing. <laughs> my old computer would combust. Are you ready? You have it open? One a moment, though. I believe in you. Um, so maybe I want- So those are playing Pokemon too. Um, welcome back, lolololol. But I want to paste the thing. Shut up, you're stupid. You're not. No, I said YouTube is dumb. <laughs> that was an accident. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it is really super messy. Oh, <laughs> it's kind of true. Jeremy is an adolescent teen, um, I wouldn't blame him for having a messy room. Um, I put a survey on the this channel. The server. On the server. Yeah. Yes. I, I wanted to paste a link in the first- Snerver. You should knew. Over. Okay, are we ready to play? Are we going to play? <laughs> um, yeah. I always have. Yeah, if you guys screenshot this out of context, it's excellent. Oh, don't mind anything. Uh, announcements. Don't mind anything. I have a response. Oh. Christine. Oh, Christine. I want to do her route. We have one vote for us. I'm down for Christine. She has a cute backpack. It's so cute. Her sprite is just. I love her sprite. Should we never? Oh, no. Okay. So. <laughs> now we should actually play. Are you ready? Like, stay on YouTube and watch the stream. I'm just gonna, uh, like, leave my game. <laughs> Go for the game. <laughs> play yourself. <laughs> okay. What? Text okay. I shouldn't. The game is still skipping. Stop, please. I meant that it's a joke. Okay, oh, no, it's just I'm way ahead now. Oh, <laughs> such a cute spread. I'm sorry. Okay. So, I'm at the part where he's just. Where he what? It's fine. It's fine. I can just freaking do this. Why don't I do this? Yikes. Yikers. Yeah, I know. It's super cute. The sprites are super cute. I don't need my game to be big, right? No. Scenic. Better an old lady than a friendless asshole in an emotionally manipulative t-shirt. Perfect. Look out, middle bro. Uncool Jeremy. Here is... Back. You have to narrate until we get to the part where he's at the Oh, yeah, right. 
I walk oh, over no. to my MacBook Pro and <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I am leaving now. Pop <laughs> out chat. Pop out chat. <gasps> this is incredible. Excuse me, Mr. Squip. Squipatron. I can't Squip say that out loud. Five. My little brother is very near. <laughs> no. I believe you. <laughs> Stop. You can it's gonna be a really, really tired Jeremy here, I hope you all know. I heard its voice back in the hospital, but I thought that was just my imagination. But there's no mistaking it now, Keanu is back to haunt me. Are you real? Okay, it's gonna be the same voice. <laughs> Are you really so eager to erase all the good I did? Take some advice from your father and put your pants on. Yikes! <laughs> Yikers. Good you did, a hell of a lot of good you did. Went to the hospital, you almost took over the school. Michael probably hates me and Christine would too if she wasn't so good natured. It's true. So this is kinda cute, Alina! <gasps> yeah. <laughs> there may have been some miscalculations. I roll my eyes, it's too early to be arguing with it. At least it isn't shocking me anymore, though that might have been because of the Mountain Dew Red. It's strange though, it hasn't said anything mean about me yet. Maybe the red zapped some sense into it. Fix your hair, Jeremy, you look like a slob. Wrecked! What is it? Yeah, I kind of assumed that. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, it's Cat! Welcome to the stream, Cat. Do we have a vote a vote on our new bolster? I don't know. Thank you. Everything about your fashion sense makes Thank me you. want to die, and I'm not even a living being in the first place. Yet oh no. We have a situation. What's the situation? Is it like three ways? Yes. <laughs> yes, we got <gasps> we have of them. One vote for Christine, one vote for Michael, one vote for Breck. Ah, uh, I want to do Brooks. Didn't we say that we were gonna do Brooks? Is that wasn't that like the whole? Yeah, I wanted to do Brooks tonight. So I'm okay. So L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L <laughs> okay. Let's name. I'm gonna keep going. Uh, says the Tic Tac who dressed up like an anime villain to take over the school. Get wrecked, son. <laughs> Comments like that are why you have no friends, Jeremy. Rip. As much as I hate to admit it, the asshole in my head is right. No time to beat the meat. School beckons. I grab my old bag and grimace at it. It still says boy in big black letters. The sharpie withstanding every wash cycle I put it through. Jeremy here! Whatever. I get why you did it. It's fine. I should really just use the new bag the squid made me get, but I'm if I'm gonna own being a loser, I can't read. Again, I'm gonna go all the way. I decide to walk to school. No need to face my fellow students sooner than I have to by riding the bus. Beat the meat <laughs> retreat. No! <gasps> no, it's in common. Don't tell me that. Wait, who is here? Who is here? Shelby. Oh. Excuse me, Del. We don't need you right now. I open my bedroom door and start to head downstairs. I have everything I need. Deodorant. Don't tell me what to do. I don't need it. Jeremy here. Jeremy, you sweat more than 88% of your peers. You aren't going to make a good impression today smelling like feet. You need deodorant. What I need is some Mountain Dew Red ticket. <laughs> Oof! I heard that. How did you hear that? Jeremy, I'm inside your brain. We are metaphorically and literally sharing the space. <laughs> 
God, when did my life become a bad sitcom? My roommate is knockoff Keanu Reeves. Monday nights at 7. You cannot expect me to help you be cool if you do not cooperate. Ideally, I would utilize spinal simulation at this moment, but it appears I am malfunctioning due to your shut-off attempt. It's a shame, really. That method, that method, method was 93.7% effective at encouraging you to follow instructions. Excuse me. It was a bad way. It's trash. It was a trash method. No, cat, please, no. Well, your stupid shock therapy isn't the only thing malfunctioning, that's for sure. I don't want your help. I don't want to be cool anymore. I mean, look at all the people I hurt trying to achieve that goal. I'm not even sure I want to date Christine anymore. I just want to make no. new friends and get my life back together. And I know I want to date someone. Not sure who yet, but I know I'm tired of being single. Do you wish to set this as your new objective? I can do that. How many times must I remind you, Jeremy? My sole function is to improve your life. If you have a new objective, it's in my very programming to help you achieve it. How exactly was taking over this school improving my life? I accidentally skipped that real too fast. <laughs> you said you wanted to date Christine Canigula at any cost. You specifically said it didn't matter how. Damn it, I did say that. And computers don't understand hyperbole. No matter how advanced. Good job, idiot. Anyway, I look at this whole mess, and it's still all my fault. Anyway, I can't read. Bye. Jeremy, if you want to talk to Michael before class, you need to leave for school now for optimal conversation length. I almost want to hang around at home for a bit longer just to spite the squip, but I really need to see Michael. I'd hate him to think I was abandoning him like I did before. I sigh and gather my things. No need to start the day in a bad mood. I ruined a lot of things in this past month, and it's up to me to fix them. Feeling a bit more motivated, I slam my door behind me and begin my walk to school. The game is starting now. Ah, oh, high school. I never thought I'd miss you. It's almost nice to be back in such a familiar hellhole. Are you there? Is Are we in the same space now? Um... Becca, are you okay? <laughs> what happened? I... You almost over at the... What? Hmm? Okay, I could turn. What text bubble are you at? Anyway. This is you. I was just on a different tab. Oh, okay. Um, as I put in my combination, I realize I'm waiting for Rich to strut up behind me and shove me. But he won't be doing that anymore. We've almost become friends being hospital buddies and all. He also understands better than anyone how awful it is to have a split tormenting you. I glance around and notice people staring. Great, looks like General and let everyone know what went down at the play. <laughs> Sorry, Jenna. <laughs> I hear a girl next to me whisper something about ecstasy pointing towards me. RIP! Okay, so maybe it wasn't Jenna. Say what you will about her gossip, but she usually gets the facts right. Usually. Sometimes. Pulling some books out of my locker, I sigh, silently praying no one tries to talk to me today. Especially not any of the cool kids. I doubt they would want to strike up a friendly conversation after the whole squipsident. Ha <laughs> ha! The Jake boy. Jake! Do you want me to read Jake? Sure! You'll hear! <laughs> I can't do a dumb voice. <laughs> it's okay. Huh? Jake? Why is he talking to me? He's here to make fun of me. Abort! Abort! Uh, who's the squid? Juke! <laughs> He's not here for that purpose. Stay. Hey, man. Oof. Okay. Um. Abort night. No. Okay. So maybe not. 
Yeah, the school may be more miserable than the hospital. Man, I am not used to having to look down at Jake. I wonder how long he's going to be in that wheelchair because of what I did. Okay, technically he didn't break his legs because of me. He was escaping the Halloween fire. But he would be healing a lot quicker if he hadn't okay. gotten squipped and walked on his broken legs. That was definitely my fault. It doesn't look like anyone signed his cast. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Hey bro, I appreciate the attention to my lover air. I, <laughs> I wasn't, I mean, I swear I was looking at. This is not how I imagined this conversation would go. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help but notice the wheelchair. Are you okay? Really, man. I really messed up my legs walking the vine of this baby. Aww. Like, emotionally and stuff is all good. This chair doesn't change anything. Soon I'll be out there, ruin school again. Plus, it's a killer workout for my arms. <laughs> He flexes. Jesus. <laughs> Jeremy here! Jeremy by here! <laughs> Only we had kept this extra ship workout system. You could have muscles like that in no time, Jeremy. Oh, shut up! See, still in top tier shape. Yeah, you have good arms. What? <laughs> that sounded intelligent. I mean, you lift a lot, bro. Leave <laughs> room for Jesus. Good job, Belina. <laughs> I don't know, maybe you were born with the world's most perfectly symmetrical face. I like this sprite a lot. I'm definitely, how are you doing? As good as I can. I like all of the sprites. I know. I keep expecting everyone who glances at me to punch me in the face. It's not like I don't deserve it. Just said it. No one even knows what, what cast members in your buddy might. I think Jenna's telling everyone we just did. Not a word about scripts or how I might. Aww, Jenna. That's slightly less humiliating. At least that explains why no one's beaten me up yet. Oh, but if I were you, I'd still clear of Canigula too. Guess that leaves out Christine. Sorry guys, we're doing bro. <laughs> <laughs> it was destined well, would... no. Right, she probably doesn't want to talk to the kid who facilitated the whole robo apocalypse just to get in her pants. Oof! Finish it. Score keeps cutting. Aw. Uh, fight. Stop. <laughs> whoa, 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 dude. She's mad about that. Well, she's a little mad about <laughs> that. But I haven't really asked. Aw. Word, Christine. Word. Again, my fault. <laughs> no. Oh. You at? Um. Wait, wait. Are you at Jake's text bubble? Which one? <laughs> uh, you should offer to help raise the money. Are you at the next one? Offer to help. Okay, Xerxes, get out of here! No! <laughs> no! Xerxes, Bitch. leave! Xerxes, get out! Bitch. Hey, you're right, that's a great idea, but, um, Jake? Not that I don't appreciate it, but why are you helping me? Honestly, I'd understand if you didn't even want to talk to me, but you are. And you're helping me hit on a girl that you also like? 
Dixie's meta. I had a lot of time. I will hunt you down. I think in the hospital, you know? And I don't really have that much in common. I think we're gonna take some time before diving into another relationship. Uh -huh. Oh, did I say we? I want to say <laughs> someone I can really connect with. Someone that just fits. Hmm. I don't just want to take my way to the junior class. I want a loving relationship. You feel me, bro? Xerxes, I will fight you. Your name is already in the death note. Your <laughs> your life is short lived. You'll find the right girl, Jake, or guy, whatever floats your boat. Ugh, that sounded stupid. Way to blow your chance at staying friends with Jake Dillinger, Crown Prince of the Cool. Pr Prince of the Cool. What? Fighting you would get me to Arizona? I mean, yeah. <laughs> I'm glad to see you acting optimistic, even after all that. Speak for yourself. I feel like shit, but both of your legs are broken and you still look like you're on top of the world. That's the thing, man. Legs heal, but you can't even imagine. Full disclosure, bro. It might take a while before you're feeling right again. But that's okay, because I'm here too. So, hey, I gotta go. But if you ever want to go to Sabaros or something, hit me up. Yeah, maybe I will. I'll let you know. Sure. Cool. Hope you to see you, dude. Rolling out. It was Jake! What a lame joke. Did he just make a wheelchair pun? Glad to know even the coolest guy in school can be a dork sometimes. Maybe Jake isn't so scary after all. That's weird. Michael is usually waiting here for me in the mornings. Are you all ready for hecking Michael? Um, um, um. Well, I guess it's been a while since I've been here to meet him. Michael should hate my guts. It's honestly astounding that he's forgiven me. A small part of me hopes he is still mad. I mean, I deserve it. <laughs> You wanna be Michael? Oh, look at my dude. Look at him. Can we just gaze upon him for a minute? Alina, you're a big mood. Pick up. Where did she go? Oh no. Get yeah, going again. I'm terrible at this. You wanna yes. be Michael? Just like what? You wanna be Michael? Yes, I can. It's this freaking Discord being trash. Fight. I just don't want to make it sound like I'm talking to myself a bunch of times. Don't worry, I'll read it. Apparently. <laughs> Ever played two? Uh, oh, 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 right. Michael, it's good to see you. I jump at Michael and crush him in a bear hug. I am never going to abandon him again. Shit, this is a long hug. I add two pads to his back so it's not gay. And something strikes me. Player two? I'm player one. It's gone gay. Hot! Oh, jeez. This <laughs> is You okay, Becca? I think so. My laptop is crying. Oh, that's a big mood. Uh, would you like me just to screen share with you so that you're Laptop doesn't have to. Look. That might be better. Yeah. Yeah.
Okay, I can do that. I can handle that. Bye. Um, my um, poor, poor laptop. And on screen, share, and touch. Excuse me. No, stop that. Stop that. It's not okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. I know how to do it now. Okay, we're good. That's not correct. Great. Cool. Oops. Cool, cool, cool. What about the Discord server? Yeah. Send it in the Discord. What link did you send? What did I do? I didn't do anything. Alina sent something, I believe. Is Where? computer suffering less in the Discord server? Oh. Mm -hmm. But what channel? What There's channel? So There's so many. It's Christine! Christine. Did you mean the mushy animation? Oh, I've oh, seen that one. Yeah. It's so good. I agree. Okay, okay. So, can you see the screen? Okay? Yes. Okay. That? Oh, oh, I don't want it all the way. No good. Okay, um, you're good. Okay. Why not? Jeremy here, if you can name one game. Yeah, that's the title of player one. Okay, fine. Whatever. But that was a low blow, man, and you know it. Shut up, you know you love me, and that hug you- <laughs> <laughs> I've seen all of this. It was a bro hug! Bro hugs aren't gay! Michael laughs. I missed hearing that laugh, and I doubt he's laughed much since I disowned him for a while. But now that I'm hearing it again, it's quickly becoming my favorite sound in the world. So, are you gonna ask Christine out today? I'm not sure. You're not sure? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you bored a supercomputer to be with- How can you be having second thoughts? Oh my god, never ever say that again. It's not that I don't like Christine, I just don't know her very well, and there's plenty of nice people in school. Besides, now that I'm not cool, I'd be surprised if she even spares me a glance. Don't think that way. You know I've always thought you were the coolest. Aw, great. That's one vote in my favor out of the hundreds that attend this shithole. Michael punches me lightly. I would also like to go on record that I liked Jeremy here before he was cool. It's Alina, I agree with you. It's very gay. Shut up, you fool. Incredibly gay. gay. <laughs> Michael's laugh seems more forced this time. Maybe I should lay off on the friendly teasing for a bit until we patch things up more. Also, I have to ask, are you doing okay, man? In the head? Yeah, I'm okay, all things considered. Are you okay? And slaying. By the way, are you coming over after school? We could finally move on to level 10 of apocalypse. Damn. Grab some slushies, you know, for old time's sake. I'd love to, Mike. I miss you. But Jake already invited me somewhere, and I have drama club after school. I'll have to let you know. Right, of course. I've forgotten some popular kids bought sock and drew me here. Oh, Xerxes. Wow, that was a long time ago. That's like a couple of months. Oh, no, think about that. Shoot, <laughs> I know that look. That's the look he gave me after we had that fight on Halloween. I'd better say something. Hey, I'm not abandoning you. Never again. You know no one could replace you. I, I know that better than ever now. Oh, dude. <laughs> Forgot I was reading. That was incredibly gay. Uh-huh. You're gay. That I am. Your mom's gay. Both of them are. 
I smile and start to snicker along with Michael. I pull him into a side hug as we keep laughing together. God, I miss you. Michael's heart rate is increasing. What? <laughs> I'm helping you find a suitable romantic partner, but it seems as though Michael is very interested. <laughs> what? Would you like me to set Michael as your objective, Jeremy? He is both single and willing. What? <laughs> huh? Shoot, I said that out loud, but how was I not supposed to with the actual fuck? What was that, Jeremy? Uh, I don't want to tell him the squip is back yet. Then he'll be concerned all day. I'll tell him later. It's not like it's doing anything right now. Except being incredibly annoying. <laughs> Sorry, I was just thinking to myself. Readjusting to only having one voice up here. I'm fine, I swear. Right. Michael doesn't look convinced, but I doubt he'll press it. Well, I'm also class, I guess. The Michael route is too hard, Alina! <laughs> I mean, I know all the right answers. Yeah. But I don't want to do it again. <laughs> yeah, we gotta do a new one. For you. Oh, and Jeremy? Yeah? If you're going to come, don't be late. If I start playing... Oof! Promise, even if we don't hang out today, I'd really love to. I'm sorry about everything, but we're going to be fine, right? What's he going to say? Are we finally going to talk about this? For sure. Anyway, just come over later if you want to hang. I'm not going anywhere. You got it. See you later, player two. Excuse me? Um, see you later, player one. See you later, Jeremy. Michael's a good friend. I mean, he used to be my only friend. I'm glad we were able to have a normal conversation, but it still felt a bit forced. I'd do anything to get back to what we had before. I can't live without my favorite person. Same here, Jeremiah. <laughs> Jeremiah. I love you, Becca. I love you too. I should head back to class before I'm late. I'll decide what to do later. We only have three votes on the survey. It's all in different directions. <laughs> Time to yeah. math and turn in three weeks worth of homework. I should really get to class early so I have time to discuss what I missed with the teacher. My math class is on the other side of the building. Yes, I'm running. Just one more hallway and... Ow! Ah! Girl! Brokey cookie! Oh, man, shoot, I'm so sorry. Are you? Well, yeah, so of salty. course. It was my fault. I wasn't looking where I was going at all. I'm okay. I believe Brooke is waiting for an apology. <laughs> what do you mean? I just apologized to her. <gasps> Jeremy. Brooke is under the impression that you slept with Chloe Valentine at the Halloween party. Oh, oh, oh shoot. Uh, I'm such an asshole. I'll see you later, Jeremy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, Brooke, I... Here goes nothing. I'm sorry about everything. I treated you like garbage and I never apologized for it. But I want you to know that I'm truly sorry and didn't want to use you like that. But you still did. Oh, yikes. You know, there's no excuse for that, squip or not. I also want you to know that I didn't sleep with Chloe at the party. She told me you were the one waiting for me up there. Yeah, I know that wasn't your fault, Jeremy. It was Chloe's fault. I'm never gonna speak to her. Oof! But you did stay up there with her. Oh my gosh, Alina, I just saw this. Congratulations. Oh! Amazing! It's not like I wanted to. Someone took control of my legs so I couldn't move. You said it didn't matter how, Jeremy. In order to become cool, you had to have experience with the opposite sex and you weren't cooperating. I was only doing what you requested. Shut up, I do not need this from you right now. Let me make it up to you. Uh, that wasn't the first time I've been cheated on, Jim. Don't say you didn't cheat, because you might as well have. 
It had been Christina Day, which has really stayed faithful to me. I don't know. The whole thing was messed up, Brooke. I was only dating you to become popular. I used you. And I apparently forgot all about it. Nice going here. I hope you can forgive me one day, because I think you're really sweet and kind. And I wasn't lying when I told you that you were be beautiful. I can't read. Beautiful. Go on. If you'd give me the chance, I'd love to try to fix things. Brooke looks me up and down with a blank it. Is that what it said? Yes, with a blank expression. <laughs> then she sighs and lets herself smile a bit. You like you, you're so cute. Oh, look at her smile. She's so precious. She's my brookie Jackie. And Michael told me it was a great time for you, even. He told me that, what was it, Squip? He said it said awful things to you. But that doesn't excuse. No, it doesn't. But I didn't chalk everything up to What? I didn't chalk everything you did up So if you really want to give Sam a shot, I think I'd like something like that. I'd like to be friends at the very least. <laughs> okay, so I was laughing. <laughs> the conversation is dying, Jeremy. Flirt a bit. Tell a joke. Squip, he needs to go to math class. I don't know what <laughs> You know I'd be lost without you. Get out of here, Jeremy. Get out of here. <laughs> I see you broke out of Twitch, and then she snorts loudly and giggles. That was so stupid, Jerry. It appears I should not have trusted you to do that on your own. Oh my god, I can't believe I said that. I'm gonna leave now. No, no, it was cute. You must really be sorry if you don't think me that you care. It wasn't that stupid. <laughs> it really was. Yeah, okay. It was. <laughs> we can end a pink fairy together and just talk. Well, give you a ride. That sounds fun, but I'll have to let you know. Everyone wants a piece of me today. Jeremy, that's not the correct thing to say. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> oh, okay. But I'd love to come. If I can't today, we can do it some other time. I promise. Okay, I'll see you later, Jeremy. I watched Brooke leave, wa walking with a little spring in her step to which wherever her first class is. I should be heading to my next class, too. It's the first class! You don't say next <laughs> class, <laughs> <laughs> Super fun, Jeremy. Meg, what you doing? I speed walk through the hallway, grateful that Brooke isn't too mad at me. I'm glad she's willing to give me another chance. It was weird seeing her without Chloe by her side. I wonder if those two will patch things up as well. Chloe told me that Brooke said they were cool, but Brooke is still hurting over what Chloe did to her, and what I did to her, obviously. I wonder if I should help Brooke fix things with Chloe or just leave it alone. It's not like I know either of them that well, but if they're anything like Michael and I, they probably really miss each other. I put my thoughts to rest and reach my classroom door and enter silently. Oh boy! This is it. This is it. It's time! This bathroom always smells like weed, and today is no exception. There's a couple slammed against one of the walls making out. Jesus, can't a guy just do his business in peace? Glare at them with authority. Then they will find somewhere else to spread mono. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Doing that, I look about as intimidating as a preschooler. Alternatively, you could give a deep, throaty, masculine grunt. But after being in your head for several weeks, I am positive you are incapable of producing such a sound. I try anyways, just to prove it wrong. A noise leaves my lips that sounds like a cross between a terrible voice crack and a dying animal. It makes the couple part from their lip block and awkwardly shuffle out the door. Uh, mission accomplished. Anyways, back to business. Looking around, I realize this is the same bathroom Rich told me about squits. Maybe this bathroom is cursed to forever interrupt my theme. I wonder how Rich is doing. He didn't call or text me all weekend, and I don't know when he'll be released from the hospital. <laughs> Xerxes! Why is there a handsome? <laughs> Ooh. Jeremy? Rich? Jeremy? 
bitch, what are you doing here? Embarrassed, I quickly zip up my pants and back up a bit. I see Rich grin widely, looking around. Whoa, serious deja vu. What are you doing out of the hospital? That drab old place could handle a new... Yes! Or I guess old and improved. Well, that and the nurses said I can leave as long as I keep taking... Good job. He's muscular because Jelly is the one that drew him. <laughs> he loves muscles. That, that's Jelly's defining art trait. <laughs> muscles. Like, I love her, but she loves her muscles. Rich is wearing a tank top, and I can see heavily scarred tissue all over his arms. They're from the fire, of course. I haven't seen them before. Rich was in a full-body cast in the hospital. He told me he had scars, but seeing them still breaks my heart. Rich walks over to the urinal to do his business. I suppose I should be going. So, how was your first day back? Seriously, how can you talk while he's, you know? It's been weirdly not terrible. I mean, a lot of people are staring at me in the halls, and I know Michael's still upset, but he won't talk about it. But the good news is, all my limbs are intact, which I did not predict. <laughs> Must be nice. Oh yeah, Rich committed arson, and the whole school is likely still a rumor mill about it. He probably isn't having a good day. Plus he has- Tell Flame School can't handle me anymore. Um, 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 oh. Glad to hear? So, you still been quite made up with your boyfriend? Boyfriend? I don't have a- Oh. For the last time, bitch, Michael isn't my boyfriend. Did the stream die? Um, it was for a little bit. Oh, okay. I think it's- it should be back now. Oh. oh my... Is everyone here again? Let me check real quick. It says it's fine. Oh no, never mind. It doesn't say it's fine. <laughs> what is it? Um, give me a minute. Okay, let's see. Um. Hmm. Are you okay, OBS? Let me... Apparently my laptop is suffering too. You know. It's whatever. It's back for you? Okay. Cool. Hopefully it's all good. Oh, it's back. It's back. Okay, okay. Alright. Seriously? He was oh, in your bad. hospital more than your dad. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I know. Because my dad works. He brought you flowers. I was in the hospital. It's a common and completely platonic gesture. You guys have matching backpacks. You were the one who wrote on them in the first place. Yeah, you're welcome. It's clearly <laughs> destiny now. Look, we are not and never have been dating. Just because Michael's gay doesn't mean that I am. Are you? Am I what? Are you gay? No, I like girls. I mean, I think some guys are hot, but that's normal. But everyone thinks that from time to time. You can't like both, right? Dude, I'm gonna tell you that's gonna blow your mind. I skipped a word there. <laughs> I'm bisexual. Ladies, dude, both, both are good. I told you all this in the hospital, man. Must have been right after I woke up. I only have spotty memories of those first couple of days in the hospital. They had me on some crazy painkillers. Bisexual, huh? Well, maybe that's what I am. Say it with confidence, Jeremy. I take a deep breath and puff out my chest dramatically. You know what? Yeah, I'm bi too. Guys are nice and there's a few of them I'd like to kiss. No one can shame you. Time for freshman year. Oh, L, you better go do that chat room. Fast, fast. He was one of the first guys I noticed, and it opened the floodgates of Venus. Now I can all the beautiful dudes around me. I'm truly blessed. Nice. Here's your squip, shocked him for gay thoughts. 
Hold on, give me a second. Man, poor guy. Meanwhile, my squid tried to set me up with Michael this morning. I merely informed you of a potential partner, Jeremy. There are plenty in this school, and I will help you pursue whoever you choose. How did my squid go from a hive mind making super villain to my own personal matchmaker? Yeah, hello. I'm not sure this is much of an improvement. And now all the guys and gals from Little Road can have dating this guy. Yes. Rich strikes a pose and kisses his biceps. There's a reason his fashion choices consist mostly of muscle tanks. So he says, don't even. <laughs> Catch you later, loser. You can stop by my place after what? You never did take me up and then offer to. Xerxes, get out. Bye, Xerxes. Rich sh shoots me a smile, a genuine smile that I've never seen from them before. He shows all his teeth, revealing his teeth cap, his eyes lighting up as they gaze directly into mine. If I didn't know any better, I'd think he was... No, no way. Rich wouldn't flirt with me. Rich walks towards the door, intent on exiting. Dude, wash your hands. Rich looks me dead in the eye, walks over, and wipes his hand on my cheek. What the fuck? No homo. He runs out of the bathroom, cackling. I try not to think about the fact that my face now has inadvertently touched Rich's tank. <laughs> what has my life come to? <laughs> Who knew I had my bisexual epiphany in a shitty high school bathroom talking? Okay, so I have to be right back because um, my mom got a new car and she wants me to see it. So, oh boy. a second. I get to entertain the yes, masses. Yes, have fun. The, the masses, I say, as there's how many people here? I don't know. I can't see the stream. <laughs> Do you want to get bigger, Mr. YouTube? I can see. Would you like to? It would be great. You would like to. How kind. I think I broke it. There's six people here. Okay, that's all I needed. Thank you. So, how are you? Uh, entertain. Uh, trick. You have fun with your chat room. Oh, well. What route are you doing? I don't know. Did everybody here do the survey? The survey I spent a whole minute making? I thank you. It's a good survey, right? ignoring you actually whose fault is that not mine 100 right here why won't you just let me see how it to the stream so let's just do this stupid survey okay I spent my precious time making a survey and three people have done it i used a template for t-shirts obviously you don't get t-shirts um you should fix that just go get food uh i have cookies i can throw them to you wherever you may be
Um, Xerxes, have you done the survey? Ellen, yeah. Gotta do that gosh dang survey. It's important. Good. Oh, amazing. We can enjoy cookies together. Cut off all my home if you didn't know. That's why lovely Xerxes here just remind me I should be doing my home. But you know, I don't need homework. I. It's a good survey, okay? I just need some responses because. Press it! Oh my god, we're at a hold up here. Three responses and there's people. And I swear to god, if you picked fourth person that we didn't already choose. You've seen everyone except for Christine. You better have picked Brooke. Brookie cookie. Press the submit button. Oh, hello. It seems he has to submitted. Uh, no! God damn you, Xerxes. How dare you vote for Michael? I can't believe this. This is betrayal. That's two votes for Michael. God damn it. Why right done, Michael, bro? Okay, so I need all of you to see again. Vote for Brooke. Brooke is the obvious choice here. <sighs> Have you not done Michael's route yet? I'm very condescending. Yeah, I need to be. You are getting me ice cream. You haven't seen Michael's route. Um, we'll see when they want to choose. We do have a majority vote for Michael here. It's like non existent. I was just sitting there looking at the outside of the park. It seems she'll be back yeah. soon. Which is understandable how he, you know, just missed yeah. it. But... Mm. No, no, it's okay, Zerx. Hello, I exist. This is so hard to open. So, so we, we have come to a conclusion. Uh huh. Uh, the survey says Michael. Oh, we're doing Michael's route? I should have expected this. Mm-hmm. Michael yep. it is. Do it. I'm okay with this. Okay. Are we ready I to can start? do the cookie cookie another time. We can do it. We can stream multiple times. We'll see. Well, I mean, we're <laughs> going to have to with this one. Yeah, we, we both don't always have time, but... Yeah. Oh, finally. Drama Club. Land of the Thespians and Home of the Gate. Sorry, Lolo. Sorry, Lolo. Even though I mostly signed up for the play to be with Christine, I have to admit it was pretty fun. Big said Christine is really upset right now about the spring musical getting canceled. It's strange. I don't think I've ever seen her truly angry before. I'll just steer clear for today. Oh wait, there's only like three other kids in drama club. That's weird. She's not here yet. I didn't think Christine would ever be late to drama club. Surprise! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Christine is so cute. My child. Did you just submit again, Xerxes? He submitted three times. Xerxes. <laughs> he submitted to... Unfortunately, I... Xerxes, the masses have spoken. You were the tiebreaker and you chose Michael. It's Michael. Michael, I'm sorry. Anyway. Welcome back, Jeremy and Miss. How was the hospital? Are you feeling okay? Oh my god, I didn't. Damn, did I? 
Oh, and I'm so, so sorry I didn't visit you. Busy organizing when I just bring you. Did you hear it's canceled? I almost cried. Okay, okay, I cried. Can you believe me? She's so precious. And also language. What? What's your language? We're in school. Christine is such a mom friend, but it's really adorable. Also, is this Christine in a bad mood? She seems completely fine. All of a sudden, Christine bolts upright in her seat, and she reaches down and starts furiously rooting through her bag. She looks really determined. Hey, uh, Christine? Shh, one sec, I'm looking for something. The school paper printed a review of the site and I wanted to show it to you. I can't find it. I know I left it in my bag. Or maybe I left it on the kitchen counter. Big mood. I know I was rereading it when I was trying or What if it's in the refrigerator? Maybe someone took it. <laughs> It's kind of a mixed review, but they said you did really well in your first scene. Okay, who put their name as E on the survey? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Was that you? Um... Who was, who was saying E earlier? Alina? Yes. Was that you, Alina, voting for Michael? I see you. <laughs> I see you. Oh, you read it! Hey, did you take my school news to your me? No, Michael brought it to me in the hospital. He thought I could use a laugh. Naha, here it is. Christine hands me an article highlighted in various colors and bordered in glitter blue doodles. I think my favorite part is when they say, it says the play became more interesting after Pug Serum. It looks like the script saved the play. <laughs> I like the part where it praised me for my animated performance fighting against an invisible tormentor, even if it made no sense in the context of the story. I like that the whole paragraph debating whether or not Michael's play is done with his plan by way is to bring attention to the drama program. Please leave. Please leave. Actually, please leave. Thank you. Ah yes, Michael has finally achieved his lifelong goal of becoming part of a conspiracy theory. Isn't there a whole paragraph where it just talks about Chloe's eggs? <laughs> Are there even any teachers moderating what the newspaper teams put in there? I heard she got that paragraph framed. And again, language. We laugh a bit at the ridiculousness of it all, but I can tell something's bothering Christine, and I'm pretty sure I know what it is. Look, I'm so sorry, Christine. It's true, LOL. I thought you were out of this fandom. Jonathan, can you please leave? Did you know I'm streaming right now? Did you know people can hear you? No, dude, but no, no, I'm fine. Hey, can you please not, though? Okay, bye. No, no, Jeremy. Aw, I love you too, Xerxes. Just let me say this, okay? I fu- I messed up. I ruined the play because I thought I could cheat at life. I didn't think of how I was affecting anyone else. That was selfish. And now the spring musical is cancelled. All I wanted was to get closer to you, but I ended up really hurting you instead. I know how much these plays mean to you, and I ruined one and managed to stop another. <sighs> you're right, you made a mistake. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the thing about mistakes, Jeremy. Everyone thinks, and I forgive you, please, on one condition. Anything. You're going to help me get the spring musical back. And you're going to audition for a lead. What? Christine, of course I'll help you raise money, but I'm never getting back on that stage. You know I only had the guts because well, I wanted to get to know you. I don't have any real talent. Nonsense. I just don't know if I can, well, sing. You seem to have no problem singing Whitney Houston in the shower, Jeremy. Literally did not ask. <laughs> Michael told me you're really good, so don't even give me that I can't Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> Betrayed by my own best friend. Anyway, I'm thinking because that's simple. Thanks. Jake told me the first big golf team does that fundraisers like that all the time. I'm gonna need some help planning it all though. Wanna help? You can come to the auditorium later tonight. Mr. Ray is basically lives here and 
kids don't like the students. I'll let you know. Everyone seems to want to hang with me today, which is exactly the opposite of what I thought would happen. That's okay, but my office still stands. Finish early enough, we can start listening to the yes. Wicked soundtrack. I'll make it easy to geek out of you yet. Good choice. Sounds good, Chris. <laughs> good afternoon, <laughs> students. Today we'll be continuing our improvising. Get in your partner groups to practice. And remember, we still have an imp two weeks. Curse. Missed you here. I know you've been absent, but if the fall play taught us anything, no problem with improvision. I look down, embarrassed as Christine cracks up beside me. No, oh, and Jeremy, come with me. It's your turn to heat up my hot pocket. Oof. Oh joy. I stick out my tongue at Christine for laughing at my pain. That only makes her laugh harder. I get up and follow Mr. Reyes out of the auditorium. So, I hear ecstasy is the new hot drug. Uh-oh. God, what a day. I'm frankly exhausted when I return home, but the thought of hanging out with one of my friends keeps a smile on my face. Even if a part of me wants to stay up and cancel on everyone in favor of taking a nap instead. I strongly advise that, Jeremy. This is a prime opportunity for you to start a relationship with one of your friends, whoever it may be that you choose to pursue. Plus, you've been in the hospital doing almost nothing but sleeping for the past week. You're a lazy piece of garbage, Jeremy. Me too. Hey, I thought we were done with the insults. Don't you have a new objective now? Affirmative. But I still should be able to express my opinion. And in my opinion, you're a lazy piece of garbage. Do you want me to read the clip? I mean, you can. Well, your opinion stinks, in my opinion. Ha, got him. <laughs> anyway, we have about half an hour to go into the meeting you choose, so I suggest we spend it preparing you for the dating role. How am I supposed to practice dating in my bedroom? Play a dating sim? <laughs> I love you, Meg. Meg and Meek. destroyed. Good job. Um. Pixies. <laughs> <laughs> of course oh. not. Dating sims are neither help. And they're exceptionally simple to program. Don't look at the screen like that, Squip. Fourth wall destroyed. Really? Uh, it's easy to program a game? Child play. Point is, a dating sim will not help you. It's not immersive enough. Are you sure about that? I conducted <laughs> extensive research on the topic that in dating is a very complex process with many unpredictable outcomes. I concluded the only way to, pra to practice going on a date is to go on a date. Best advice 2018. <laughs> go on a date. I'm sorry, I think I'm missing something. How am I supposed to go on a practice date in my bedroom? I will take the role of your potential suitor so you may learn oh, no. going on a date. Think of it as sort of a tutorial. Don't you look at me like that. <laughs> Right after it says that dating can't be simulated with a video game, it goes on to describe it like a video game. Stupid computer. I'm not going on a practice date with you. This is like, so weird and wrong. Do you want a girlfriend or a boyfriend, Jeremy? I don't know. Yes. Good night. Let me see. <laughs> then you must do as I instruct. Would it help if I assume my sex <laughs> female sex? God, no! Very well, let us begin the simulation. Bam! Time for choices! 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 I'm glad I get to interact today, Jeremy. <laughs> In my opinion, you seem to be an adequate human in relative society. I am inclined by our programming to get to know you better. Excellent. <laughs> this is so unbelievably stupid. This is the only way you'll learn, Jeremy. Play along. Fine. Let's just make it quick, though. I am inclined to gather more facts about you, so I'm inclined. We are attentive. Compatible. What is your favorite food? 
Oh boy, off to the small talk. My anxiety is already up. Uh, I said pizza. I want to save the souls of the innocent. Do it. <laughs> Interesting. Now return the question, Jeremy. It's common courtesy. Um, what's your favorite food? Hey, the computer. Inside your brain. <laughs> So I am incapable of adjusting anything, and you now require food as a question. Don't you roll your eyes at me! <laughs> you told me to return the question! Oh my gosh. No matter which food you answered, it would not have changed the outcome. Which is, which was that we don't have a favorite food in common. Some things you will say will be like that. A response may not affect your partner's reaction of your relationship at all. Are you sure about that? Because <laughs> <laughs> the route we're going on. But some things I say will, right? Naturally. Now, Jeremy, what is your favorite thing to do for fun? Two bagel. Stand up straight, that great. hurts too much. I have never played a video game, so I have no personal opinion on it. Well, opinion is in the right way. I am not a free thinking being and cannot form my own opinion. That is the boundaries of my programming. You just said, in your opinion, Jeremy is a piece of gold. Oh, Excuse God. me. <laughs> what are you saying? Rabbit. Okay, but in your non-opinion, what seems like a fun <laughs> video game? Oh, seems like an adequate way to waste time. <laughs> no, thank you. That's a food, though. Because you answered in a way that had no significance either way to me, our compatibility has remained stagnant. Think of it like a point system. Stop looking at me. As improvement points increase, so does our compatibility, and it will... You understand? Healthy relationship, that's what I go for. <laughs> that's the end goal. Do not understand this in the slightest. What a big mood. Well then, since you lack the competence to grasp my already dating, let's continue. You do on your you're on your own this time, Jeremy. What will you say to me next? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I, think I, I think I complimented him. I wonder what would happen if he held his hand. <laughs> <laughs> it must be super complex to be as smart as you are. Of course, scopes are an unparalleled tech. Revolutionize this world. Yeah, you must be almost as efficient and intricate as Internet Explorer. <laughs> Get right. Jamie, I'm going to give you an out. And... Are you attempting to be humorous? I need to recover. <laughs> Google Chrome? Never heard of her. Firefox can guess my butt. Internet Explorer will forever be the best browser. And you have the idea. Uh, uh, frick. Audacity to call me the psychopath? What can I say? Everyone loves an underdog. Not if that underdog takes 20 seconds. Stop rolling your eyes. It makes me self conscious. This quick really <laughs> gags and looks as if it feels unclean, even disgusting in an explorer. That's such a mood. I have never seen this quip actually look uncomfortable before. I decide to drop the subject, but file the information away for later in case it decides to start being an a-hole again. I believe we have practiced to the point where you cannot possibly improve a on a real date. And lucky you, you have five gentle dates to- Oh, I'm sorry, Xerxes. Oh, Hold up, floppy disk. If you're gonna try to help me, we need to make one thing clear. I'm not going to let you control me again. That means I don't want you to tell me what to say and do all the time. Oh, <laughs> very well. But <laughs> should you find yourself in a fight, I can always provide you with the thing to say. I expected there to be like a hint button and it just pops up with this clip being like, no. <laughs> Like phoning a friend on who wants to be a millionaire? Yes, like that. Oh no. And on that note, 
Square time. Yes. Time. Look at her. It's Ada! Oh, hi. Pupper. Hey, you pupper. Okay. You like yours. Jimmy, the time has come for you to make a decision. Yeah. Well, it's time. It's time. It's time. What? You must choose what you wish to pursue with my help. I am also programmed to help you win the romantic section. This is different than just getting you laid, Jeremy. Although that is a challenge in itself we have yet to overcome. Romance takes time. It takes a lot of hard decisions. So I need you to decide who you want me to help date. Your actions here will determine. Shoot, right now that seems kind of cut and dry. It works for the sake of simplicity. I find I have to do that often. Now, who is the person you wish to date? <gasps> eh, oh, Babe. That's me. That's me right there. Save. Save. Oh, I you didn't. didn't save. I didn't save. You didn't save. No, I did not. It's time for <laughs> Michael. <laughs> I walk briskly down the road to where Michael's house is, trying to ignore the squid hovering obnoxiously beside me. It's not too late to turn back, you know. What, did I leave something at home? Metaphorically turn back, Jeremy. You're aware that Michael didn't invite you I don't know, Rainbow seems pretty accurate. Oh well, yeah, we're gonna play video games. All I'm saying is that it's a shame that you chose Michael. <laughs> Brooke! Yikes! Hold on, I'm just gonna like... these Because I need her. Excuse me, bring it back please. This is the second time... Please bring it back. Hmm. It begs the question, just how Oh yeah. Besides, <laughs> back to my old self and fix my relationship with Michael. I don't have the time or energy for dating. Not to mention it would be a huge slap in the face to abandon Michael again to date one of the same people I abandoned him for. I pull out my keyring and unlock the door, heading down to the basement on instinct. I'm glad the squip never made me get rid of my keys to Michael's. This year. This is why the gay room was started. You two are like an old married couple. What nerve do I have to block to get rid of you? It's nice to be back here. My husband <laughs> come to me. It's really good. It's a really good background. I'm so proud of everyone on the BLS project. <laughs> good job, Meg. Good job, background artist. Um, Fishy. Love it. Good job. <laughs> The mail house is like a second home to me. I don't see Michael anywhere right away, which is odd. Hey, Michael, are you home? <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Wow, what a warm and inviting welcome. Michael yes. materializes Hello. from some dark corner where the torn beanbags were thrown to die. I feel vaguely threatened. You should. Nice to see you too. Michael walks over to me and reaches out a hand. What? What is he doing? Oh shoot, handshake! The super secret! Ultra best friend of Mike and Jeremy, handshake! PM! I move to initiate the handshake, but Michael's already withdrawn his hand awkwardly, stuffing it into his hand. No! Oh, little boy. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't think he would come. Excuse me. Seriously? Come on, dude, why wouldn't I? Because you made it seem like you weren't going. Obviously. <laughs> You really, really did, Jeremy. I mean, you have other friends now, and I get that. I'm just the same old and I'm not going anywhere, so logically, I just thought you'd go for something else. No way. I got invited to do stuff with Christine, Rich, Brooke, and Jake, but here I am. With my best bud, right where I belong. Wait, 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 wait. You turned down Jake Dellinger and Christine? The same Christine you moan so much? That sounds like you sing things sometimes. Haha, <laughs> funny. I do not. Yeah, you do. 
Well, sorry to burst your bubble, but I still can't talk to girls, even after everything. Love you too, Xerxes. Bye-bye. Bye, Xerxes. I trail off. Not sure if I want to touch on that hot topic. Uh, speaking of hot topic, I went to hot topic today, and I saw a V-pin, and it was excellent. <laughs> <laughs> Michael's face hardened, and I instantly regret bringing it up. All the playful spirit in Michael's eyes is gone. Listen, I'd love to get right off the dirty... But I need a slushie. You in? The dirty sheet? You know, the whole... Uh, you screwed me over for that dumb... <laughs> it's happening, but not on every stomach. Right. I somehow feel like I've been dreading this since before I even got the damn thing. Got it. Let's go. I follow Michael up the stairs and out to the sidewalk, trying to hide how bad my hands are shaking by tucking them in my back pocket. Maybe this really was a mistake. But then Michael looks back and gives me a half-hearted but not ingenuine smile, and everything almost feels right again. Girl! Almost. Stop! I'm gonna keep coming back and forth and telling you. Stop. No! Okay. You good? Yes. Okay. Amazing. Um, did his hair always catch the light like that? It's kind of gorgeous, actually. Like one of those ridiculous shiny black rocks I'd sometimes find in my backyard as a kid. Huh. You wouldn't ruin your eyes if you keep shining at the sun like that. And trust me, you did not have a face for glasses. I don't know, man. I could look at V or Zen all day. So. <laughs> B.S. How would you know? Because I know you, and I know that if you're stuck in the forest third territory, you never. He says I want to escape. He knits his breast together and starts walking ahead of me. You did in Kayla um, shoes. I understand wrecked. that. Wrecked. It destroyed. Right. Ouch. Change the subject. Great. I have a guy. What to talk about? What to talk about? I've never had to think about conversations with Michael before. It's like we've been thrown off a rhythm. So, um. Watch any good documentaries lately? I don't like shit in school, and my young mind needs to be filled with knowledge. Well, I watched half of one yesterday about people killing innocent men in the island of La America. But it was high, so it was weird, right? Okay, I believe I have to go. What? I think I have to go. No. I wish I didn't. Safe. Yeah, I'm quite we'll pick this up on a later date. Yes, I'll just. We're into the Michael route. We are. It will continue eventually. We accidentally streamed. We weren't planning on doing this. <laughs> nope. Okay. Poor, poor man.